What's up everyone, Super Auto Gaming here, finally back from the hellscape that is League of Legends, and I highly recommend that you don't watch it. Please don't, God, please. Anyways, so for the video today, we're back with the Animal Game for Children, which I absolutely adore, and we are going to be playing a summon build without the heavy hitters. So this was a very odd, arbitrary request that I got from a commenter known as Wisp Gaming and takes after his father, Mr. Gaming. Any, anyways, um, it was a very odd request. Like, it was very specific. I'll just read out what he said verbatim. So, day two of asking of summon build without these pets. Horse, ox, turkey, shark, extra rules, max deers, one... Max Scalers 1, Scalers for this, Worm, Penguin. So, that might have been a lot to take in, but just bear with me. So, I'm assuming that you have to do a summon build without those four units, which I guess would be the heavy hitters, like of the core summon build. I figured Fly would be in there too, but it wasn't, so I'm definitely going to use Fly. And I like how there's extra rules where you can only use one deer. I respect that, you know. Deer is very powerful. So, we're, we're but we're not going to use deer. Fuck that. You don't need that. Um, max scalers. Now, I liked this one a lot because it was the decision you had to make between worm or penguin. And that just made me laugh, like, really hard. Because I was like, why worm? I was thinking, you know, either monkey or penguin or, or something like that. I don't know, at least, like, give me the option of using expansion because I can't use penguin and therefore I'd have to use worm. I don't know about that. You know, it could have been, like, penguin or poodle. Anyways, it, I found that really funny because I was like, oh, yeah, I'm going to use worm. But there's no way to use worm with this. I tried it so much. Um, so we just ended up using penguin. But it was it was very interesting and it was quite arbitrary, but I decided to do it anyways because I thought it'd be funny. And, you know, it was. It was also an interesting build. You know, you don't get a lot of builds um, like you're going to see. Oh, I had to drink some water. Quench, quench my fist. Um, and so we decided to go spider, uh, sheep, dog, fly, penguin. I think was the setup and I I assume dog is a part of a, a summon build you know it has it has the word summon in it you know what what do you take me for so dog I felt was was definitely good enough I also noticed that whale wasn't in the the list uh, we definitely could have gone whale um, but I guess without turkey it have been kind of weird no you still could have gone like whale um, Tiger, I guess, with with deer. Eh, you might be too weak because you don't have turkey still. But I mean, if you had a penguin and they were all level two, maybe not. Anyways, enough uh, enough rambling. Um, I figured dog would be allowed. A spider, of course, it summons something. Sheep, of course, and then you get the the penguin in and you round it off with a fly. It seemed like a fairly good team to me. Um, so that's what we went with. And the level three spider that we end up getting because I'm I'm stacking up spiders here. I thought it'd be really funny to get it. Uh, level three spider's just cool. Uh, you definitely don't see it like at all. So I definitely had to go it. And I also didn't know if like the whole game should have been summon build. Like how do you start? How does one have a summon build on turn one? Do you need three crickets? I, I don't know. Um, so I just decided that throughout the game, my, my team should mostly be a summon build, is what I thought, because it just seemed the best that way, because you could just get like really unlucky and not see like anything, but having being able to get a level 3 fish is really nice, because I get to buff up my other summon units, and that's that's of course very important. And honestly, our team right now is looking pretty good. However, it is uh, already kind of late in the game at turn 10. And my team doesn't scale that well. I don't even have a, the penguin yet. So it, it could look a little troubling here. However, this turn we finally find the penguin. And we get our level 3 spider all in one go, which is very nice. 
Um, now I just really need the level 2 fly. And then we can pop off. Wow, even getting the the double there was, was very cool. Very Chad-like for my, my doge to give me a fly like that. And now, now we're actually looking pretty good. Because we're not like super weak. We actually have a little bit of scaling. Uh, Dog works really well with the team that we have. Like, it's absolutely beautiful getting the um, fighter trigger and then you get double fly off of that and then uh, ram. So you're almost getting like, you're getting quite a few stats with Dog. Um, so I was glad that I was able to make Dog work. It seemed like it would be pretty cool in this summon build. And it sure, sure enough, it was. Um, we do see a deer here, but I was like, no, we, we might as well not. Like, the ram is perfectly fine. Deer is probably better in, like, every scenario. But I get one more summon off of it. So, there, eh, my plus two health or attack from my dog is beautiful. And thankfully, um, fly pulls through for us here. But yeah, uh, Wisp Gaming... I don't know what you're smoking, but I need some of that. And thank you for suggesting this to me. I I really enjoyed the challenge. It, I mean, I don't, I don't know if it was a challenge, um, but I enjoyed the the different play style okay, because you definitely no, you ain't seen builds like this. Tell me, tell me someone who's who's getting level three spider, okay? And uh, okay, now people use sheep now. Sheep is sleeper good, um, but no one uses dog. Dog sucks. Everyone hates dog. I mean, I just lost because of a dog. I, uh, it's bad, okay? I don't know why you pick shark. Why shark? I'm. That's what I'm stuck on. Is why shark and not fly? I feel like a shark in this build would have been funnier than a fly. Fly is very powerful as well. I would definitely say he's a heavy hitter for for this, but I, I'm gonna title it that way because um, I don't know man views and the algorithm. Uh, I'm pretty sure it works better like that, you know. It's a little clickbaity. Um, the thumbnail should should uh, solve that for me, though. But yeah, I, I hope uh, you're enjoying. I hope you like the animal game for babies and all the other games that I do. If if not, you should check them out. I mean, like, come on, man. What's you know what's the worst that could happen? You you might not like it. You might waste like five minutes of your day. But you know what? You might also not. Hmm? Now think about that for at least one second, but not too long, because then you'll figure it out. Um, yeah, that's all she wrote. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. Like and subscribe if you love me and everything about life and Super Auto Pets and you love your mom. Um, so subscribe if, if any of those fall under that. Uh, bye-bye. Uh, Have a wonderful day. Oh, God.